According to local history, sometime between 1580 and 1600, King Harinare and Roy dug this huge tank in front of his Rajmandir. The area of the pond is about 12 by 360 square. King Harinarayan had a huge kingdom with this region. King Harinarayan was a very prosperous ruler. He always thought about what was good for the people. During his reign the state was affected by drought. Crop production of the subjects was being disrupted due to drought. In front of the temple, King Harinarayan Roy dug this big dai with a lot of manpower to save the subjects from the effects of drought. According to popular belief, water did not rise in the pond even after several days of digging. The king was very worried. Dig a well inside the pond to raise the water in the pond. Still the water did not rise. In the meantime, the king's house was lit by the only sun. Suddenly, one night, the king dreamed that if his beloved wife Banumati poured a pitcher of water on the body of Shudachar in a well dug in the pond, the pond would rise. The very next day, as per the order of King Harinarayan, Rani Banumati took an earthen pot full of water and poured it into the well, and the water started gushing out of the well. But Rani Banumati could not come up from there. Drown in the lake. Even after a long search, Rani was not found. The water in the pond has risen. But King Harinarayan was saddened by the loss of his beloved consort. Due to the queen's grief, the king could no longer concentrate on ruling the kingdom. Gradually, everything in the kingdom began to fall out of his hands. In course of time all traces of the king disappeared. But even though everything is obliterated, the dai still holds the memory of the king.